Have you ever felt an unseen terror lurking in the shadows of the forest while camping? There's a certain allure to the wilderness, isn't there? The crackling campfire, the rustling leaves, the symphony of night sounds. But sometimes that symphony turns into a chilling cacophony, and the beauty of the wilderness transforms into a scene of eerie unease. This was the reality for a group of campers who decided to venture into the heart of the forest one summer. Their adventure began as any other might. Setting up tents, roasting marshmallows over an open fire, sharing stories under the vast, star-studded sky. But as darkness fell, the tranquility of the forest was shattered by chilling noises echoing from its depths. At first, they were merely unsettling, distant howls that could be attributed to the nocturnal creatures of the wild. But as the days passed, the noises grew louder, more insistent, and decidedly closer. The laughter and camaraderie around the campfire diminished, replaced by tense glances and hushed whispers. Each creak of the trees, each rustle of the leaves, seemed to echo the unseen terror that was drawing nearer. By the last night, the cheerful camping trip had turned into a spine-chilling vigil. The strange noises were no longer distant. They were right there, in the immediate vicinity of their campsite. The forest was alive, not with the sounds of nature, but with something far more sinister. And then, it happened. A terrifying encounter that would forever be etched into their memories. A presence, a force, an unseen terror that left them trembling in their sleeping bags, praying for the dawn to arrive. Nothing tangible, nothing visible. Just the chilling realization that they were not alone in the forest. The unseen terror had made its presence felt, turning their adventure into a nightmare and leaving them with a chilling memory they would never forget. The unseen terror in the forest left the group of campers with a chilling memory they will never forget. Ever had an unexpected visitor in the middle of a camping trip in the dead of night? Imagine this, you're alone, out in the wilderness far from the hustle and bustle of civilization. The only sounds are those of nature, the rustling of leaves, the distant call of a night creature. You're in your tent, cozy and warm, drifting off to the lulling rhythm of the forest's nocturnal symphony. But then, the rhythm is broken. You hear a sound. It's faint at first, a soft crunching, like the sound of leaves under a heavy foot. You chalk it up to a deer or a raccoon, maybe even the wind playing tricks on your mind. After all, the forest can be full of deceptive echoes. But then the sound gets louder, closer. It's a steady, rhythmic crunch, 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 like footsteps circling your tent. Your heart begins to race, adrenaline surging through your veins, replacing the previous calm. Then, as suddenly as they began, the footsteps stop. The silence is deafening, and the suspense, unbearable. You hold your breath, straining your ears, hoping to hear the sound of whatever it was retreating into the forest. But instead, you hear something else. A slow, deliberate noise that sends shivers down your spine, the sound of your tent zipper inching open. You're frozen in fear, your mind racing. Every horror story you've ever heard about the woods, every campfire tale, every urban legend, they all come flooding back. You're trapped in your tent, left to imagine what could be lurking outside, what could be slowly, stealthily unzipping your tent. Is it a curious bear, a mischievous raccoon, or something far more sinister? A deranged wanderer perhaps, or a creature of the night, drawn to your campsite by the smell of your food or the warmth of your fire? The possibilities are endless, and each one more terrifying than the last. You feel a cold draft as the tent flap opens wider. You can't see what's outside, but you know it's there, just beyond the thin fabric of your tent. You can't move, can't scream, can't do anything but wait and wonder. And then, as quickly as it began, it's over. The zipper is pulled back up, the footsteps recede, and you're left alone once more. Alone, but not at peace. You're left with the chilling realization that you're not as alone as you thought, that the forest holds more than just trees and wildlife. The uninvited visitor left the camper with a chilling realization of the horrors that can befall a lone camper in the woods. What happens when you lose your way in the woods and find yourself on a forgotten trail? Our final story unfolds with a group of intrepid hikers, their spirits high as they set out to explore the untamed wilderness. As hours turn into days, they find themselves in unfamiliar territory, their path obscured by the dense foliage. It's then they stumble upon it, an abandoned campsite, eerily silent, standing as a relic of a time long past. With nightfall rapidly approaching, the group decides to make camp, hoping to find their bearings by daylight. They set up their tents on the deserted grounds, the remnants of the previous campers serving as a haunting reminder of their own vulnerability. As the darkness descends, the forest comes alive with nocturnal sounds, 
the rustling of leaves and the distant hoot of an owl. But there's something else, a low, ominous hum that seems to come from the very earth beneath them. The hikers huddle together, their earlier bravado replaced by a growing sense of unease. One by one, they start to experience strange occurrences, a fleeting shadow that darts past the corner of an eye, a cold gust of wind that seems to carry whispered words, the distinct feeling of being watched by unseen eyes. Each incident, while minor on its own, adds another layer to the palpable tension mounting among the group. As the night stretches on, the hikers find themselves caught in a silent standoff with the unseen forces of the forgotten trail. Their initial dismissal of the strange occurrences morphs into a chilling realization. They are not alone in these woods. The abandoned campsite, they surmise, is not abandoned at all, but inhabited by entities unseen and unknown. With the break of dawn, the hikers hastily pack up their belongings, their eagerness to leave the forgotten trail evident in their hurried movements. The forest, once an inviting playground, now stands as an ominous labyrinth, its secrets hidden within the shadows of its towering trees. As they retrace their steps, they leave behind the forgotten trail and its unseen inhabitants. The chilling encounter, a stark reminder of the perils of venturing into the unknown. As the woods recede into the background, they carry with them an unsettling truth. There are places in this world that are best left undisturbed. The hiker's encounter on the forgotten trail serves as a chilling reminder of the dangers of venturing too far into the unknown. These bone-chilling tales are a reminder of the unknown horrors that may lurk in the depths of the forest. Each story we've shared today offers a glimpse into the darkness that can dwell in the wilderness, a place many of us consider a sanctuary. Let's take a moment to revisit these haunting narratives. Our first tale, The Unseen Terror, reminds us that sometimes the most terrifying things are those that we can't see. The fear of the unknown is a powerful force that can transform a peaceful camping trip into a nightmare of suspense and anxiety. The unseen presence, the strange noises, the inexplicable cold, all of these elements combine to create a chilling experience that our campers will never forget. Next, we delved into The Uninvited Visitor, a story that proves that even the most remote locations aren't always as secluded as they seem. The intrusion of an unexpected guest in the dead of night brings a rush of terror that's only amplified by the isolation of the wilderness. This tale leaves us questioning what, or who, might be lurking just beyond the light of our campfires. Finally, the forgotten trail took us on a harrowing journey off the beaten path. The disorienting fear of being lost is only heightened by the eerie silence and the feeling of being watched. It's a stark reminder that even familiar places can become alien and threatening when darkness falls. All three stories highlight a common theme, the fear of the unknown. It's this fear that makes us question every rustle in the leaves, every snap of a twig. It's what makes the forest seem alive, watching, waiting. It's this fear that turns an ordinary camping trip into a spine-chilling adventure. Remember the woods are full of mysteries and not all of them are meant to be discovered. Sleep tight, campers.